Drop your problem by doing this on the 31st of December before 12 o'clock in the midnight. Your life will not remain the same again. After doing this spiritual work, I am about to teach you right now. Enough is enough for the devil. It is for an opportunity, opportunity for you to drop that garment of stagnation, the garment of sorrow, the garment of poverty, the garment of shame, that garment of disappointment, the garment of sickness, the garment of barrenness, the garment of rejection, the garment of setback, the garment of miscarriage, any garment that you want to drop, you can drop it through this mist. Without doubt in your heart, you must come back with a testimony and you will never cross over with any of this problem in your life. So shall it be in Jesus' name. Amen. Do not forget, spiritual controls the physical. Pick up a stone. As you can see, this is a stone in my hand. Use it to touch your head and your toes. Then pick up your Bible and quickly move to the book of Matthew 18, 18. Matthew 18, 18. After reading it, the very thing you want to drop, that very, among all these things I mentioned, even when your own is not inside, that very thing you are about, you want to drop out of your life, like you do not need it anymore. You just have to bring it into this tone. There is power in your tongue. And with your tongue, you can bring or you can take or leave. Anything at all you can do with your tongue. The Bible said, whatever you lose here on earth is lose in heaven. You are about to do it right now. Every garment of poverty, the garment of stagnation, anything that is happening in your life, just pour it on this stone by doing it this way. You have read the Bible. First of all, this stone will touch your head, your forehead, and your toes. After reading the Bible, this is the stone. Let me give you an example on how you can drop it. Do not allow it to cross over with you. You garment of poverty. In the name of Jesus, you will never cross over with me. You have been in my life for a very long time now. You can measure the years if you know when, when the thing that you are about to drop started, okay? You have been in my life for a very long time now. And today has come to an end. You have come to an end. Poverty, you have come to an end in my life. In the name of Jesus, you blow it into the stone. Poverty is out of your life. Please go for it. Don't joke with it. People have moved from one condition to another just because of this prayer. I mean, people have done this prayer and things have turned around for them. Poverty, you blow it out. Okay. Do not forget to use this stone to touch your head and your toe. After that, you move to rejection. Rejection. I have been rejected several times. And enough is enough for the wise. Enough is enough for the devil. Enough is enough for all those rejection that has been coming my way. From today in the name of Jesus, rejection, it is over between us. I have no room for you anymore in my life. I blow you out of my life right now and so shall it be in the name of Jesus. <sighs> blow out rejection. Do not joke with this prayer. Blow out whatever you want to blow out. Just blow out anything you want to blow out into this stone. After blowing anything out, you will not say, in the name of God, the Father, Son, and of the Holy Ghost. I believe and I know it is done. I remove everything, that everything that you have just prayed, every stagnation, every poverty, every delay in my life. I drop it inside this stone and it is done and done forever. So shall it be in Jesus' name. Amen. You take this stone. Go and bury it. Don't throw it away. Don't throw it away. Don't put it inside toilet. Look for a place and just dig it. You bury it. It might not be your house. 
if you do not have a space to bury. Go and bury it. It is done. So shall your prayer be in Jesus' name. Whatever you wish to drop with this stone, I join my faith with your faith. In the name of Jesus, it is over in your life. You will begin to receive a turnaround from this moment. Whatever you have not been able to do before, you will start doing them like never before. In the name of Jesus, so shall it be in Jesus' name. God bless you. Remain blessed. Please share the video to help someone.